Hey guys, and welcome back to Shadow of the Colossus. When we last left off, well, we had a bit of a fight with a toothy, a toothy bastard. Uh, had a little bit of tooth, uh, tooth trouble, I think. Which we, we, I mean, we kind of put him to rest. We, we helped him. Uh, you know, he, he won't have to worry about his teeth anymore. Let's put it that way. But also, more important than that, we, um, we discovered that there are some people watching us. Uh, some voyeurs, if you will, that uh, have an interest in what we're doing. Now, actually, one thing that I did want to... Get off the horse. One thing I did want to look at. Oh, look. That's where they died. I guess. How many is there? One, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Have we killed eleven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, so I think there's. So each one of those is a dead colossi. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, that just got, like, significantly more ominous. Yeah, yeah now I really can't help shake the feeling that <laughs> whatever we're doing is not good. Um, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Um, well, ooh, we're going in this direction now. Oh, we're going down here. I keep thinking we're going to be heading up north because, you know, the big desert there. And there's still a whole load of cloud there to the northeast. Hmm. All right, well, let's go. Come on, Argo. Come on, buddy. Come on. Our journey is kind of moving towards a close slowly. I mean, we've still got a little bit left to do. We're 75% of the way there. Isn't it? Hang on, 16. We've done... Tw about 12, yeah, yeah, so about 75% of the way there. <clears throat> now, I, for one, so far, have thoroughly enjoyed this game. Um, do I think it's... It's like this Holy Grail, like, God-tier game? No. No, I don't quite have that opinion of it. But I think it's one of those games that would have been, like, better if you'd played it back in the day. However, however, it's certainly a must-play title. There's no shadow of a doubt there. <laughs> shadow, of the, <laughs> shadow of a doubt, get it? Because, you know... <laughs> uh, yes, I'm here all day, folks. Um, but, but, it is extremely good. It is extremely good. It will be in my top 20 for sure. It has an atmosphere, a very chilling atmosphere. Actually, you know, the more I think about it... Hmm. The more I, I was trying to think last night. I'm just going to get off the horse and walk through this. It's just easier. Um, the more I think about this game, I was trying to to rate it last night. Like, Because obviously I haven't seen the end. I don't know how the game ends. And I haven't fought the last few guys. But when I'm playing it, I'm enjoying it, and it's and it's fun. And I think, you know, yeah, it's not a bad game, blah, 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 blah. It's okay. It, it's way above average, you know. Um, but it's not it's not um, this masterpiece. And then when I actually stop and think about it, I'm like, well, actually... I mean, it kind of is. I get it. I do get why people have this in such high regard. Um... I just wish the game wasn't so empty. And I know, I know, that's the point. It has this desolate, isolated feeling, and, and that's the point. But there's so much... There's so much they could do with with um, this world, this universe. You know. Um, I don't know. I'm going to save my final thoughts for the end of the game. Um, and it did get a lot of 10 out of 10s and things like that in the reviews, which, again, I get it. I do. I understand. Um, totally. I, th I think, I mean, I don't think any game deserves a 10 out of 10. There's no game is flawless and perfect. 
um, you know, to to say that a game is is a is a ten out of ten game is I don't know. It doesn't really make any sense to me. Um, and a nine out of ten would be you know like the best game in the world. You know that would be like something that sets records and sets the bar so high that it wouldn't be bested for years. But I would say this is a so far this is an eight man. This is as close as it gets. Um, without being legendary. It's certainly unique, a very unique experience. Um, and as, as much as I think it's the downside of this game is the isolation, it's also its strength because it's, I don't know, it's, it's really cool. It's very chilling and isolating and it's got such a foreboding atmosphere to the game. But it just begs to have a little bit more of something, like, you know, anything. It's very strange in that regard. I don't think um, the controls have helped. The controls have really massively negatively impacted the game for me. Um, the controls are straight up awful. Um, and, you know, for a PlayStation 2 game, that's forgivable because, you know, PlayStation 2... Uh, twin analog sticks and all that stuff were kind of a new thing. Um, obviously, they started halfway through the PlayStation 1's life, and people were like analog sticks. What the fuck do we do with these? Um, and I was dead set against them when they first came out. I was like, I'm not using that. Give me a good old D pad. <laughs> I look back at myself now and think, you fool. Analog sticks are the way of the future, of course. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. The, the controls, I think they, they could have. Um, added an, a newer control scheme. They could have kept the original control scheme because for those who are used to it and like it, um, you know, the purists that played this back in the day, then yeah, sure, I, I understand that. But I think they, they could have um, had another control scheme for people that haven't played this game before, that are used to, you know, modern controls. Because, I mean... R2 for the uh, context sensitive action button is just straight up, well, it's just a straight up head fuck. That literally makes no sense. And your horse, um, you know, pushing triangle um, to gallop your horse and basically do anything with the horse is just, it just doesn't make any sense at all. It's almost like they looked at the control pad and they're like, okay, we've got loads of buttons here. Let's make this as awkward as possible. But does it ruin the game? You know? And the answer to that is obviously no, it doesn't. It makes it slightly awkward and a little bit inconvenient at times, but it does not um, massively, massively ruin the game. It just taints it. Um, so we're supposed to be going here, I reckon. We're going dead ahead. This is our... Ooh. There's got to be at least, I'm reckoning, two, possibly three temples. To the south. Has to be. But I would like to play Ico. Did they remaster Ico? I don't know. I'm going to have to look that up. Because Ico, this, and The Last Guardian is... Um, it, it, I know it's all set in the universe. I don't think they're necessarily connected. But they are all set in... Oh, it's got to be this thing here. But they are all set in the same universe, which is cool. Uh, the Last Guardian is a game that I was quite looking forward to. And then it came out and... Eh, I know a lot of people weren't overly into it. Um, and it has humongous performance issues. The only way to get a stable frame rate in that game is by playing it at 1080p performance mode on a PlayStation 4 Pro. Uh, apparently on the original PlayStation uh, 4, it like, drops into like 20 frames a second quite often, which is absolutely unacceptable. Oh, here we go. Okay. A frame rate like that is absolutely unacceptable. Well.
Uh, what the fuck? Okay. Uh, guess shoot its big balloon things. No? Uh, Argo, we've got a bit of an issue here, pal. I might actually need you for this one. Um, yeah, okay. So we have a giant balloon animal. I can dig it, that's cool. Um, but I'm not sure. Okay, I would say shoot the air sacs underneath it. The big grub looking things. But how the fuck? Hang on. But that doesn't seem. Oh, no, 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 no. That, that is something like. Okay, cool. So each one of these sacks is only one. You've got to lead the target by some way. Yeah. Uh, right, buddy. I'm gonna have to bring you down. Really, Argo. Really, you couldn't have just, you know. Whilst I'm trying to shoot this thing, you couldn't have just gone around the obstacle. You couldn't do that. Is that out far of your your area of expertise? Ah, bloody horse. Yeah, I still stand by that. The horse is. Yeah, the horse is the game's. Most glaring issue. Aha! Right. Now you're going to crash land, my friend, I assume. Uh, wait, what? Oh, no, no, no. Um, okay, that did not work. Argo, come here, buddy. Come on. The one time that I want you to actually... Oh, good God. Seriously? So we've got to climb up his wings now. Okay, that's not too bad. We can do that. Move your fucking asshole! Seriously, what what is your major fucking malfunction here? Yes. Okay, right. Come on. Um. Okay, that that did not work. Argo. Come on, buddy. Come on. I love you really. Papa loves you. Oh no, is he reflating again? No. Why are you going the opposite direction? Why? The opposite direction to the to the um, direction that I'm looking in. Oh my god. Okay, that's fine. Right. It didn't appear that I could actually climb up this thing. Oh god, that was a complete failure to launch right there. Okay. Now, I have to say, the design of this thing is pretty fucking cool. I'm quite the fan. Come on, buddy. Right, Argo, you've got to work with me here, pal. Right, there we go. Okay, we can. Okay. This is a little bit weird the first time. Yeah, everyone's first time's weird, you know. You have to ex expect that. Um. Um. Okay, that's fine. Right, let's have a little look at ya. Oh god, are you, you... Oh, he's taking off. Okay, that's... That's an issue. Uh, okay, so where's your sensitive region? Is it here? Nope. Um, oh god, I cannot see. Thank you. So I guess we're not going to be stabbing him in the head just yet. I mean, this guy's got quite a big body, so logic dictates. Do we have to start stabbing him at the back and work forwards? Yeah, logic dictates that 
he's going to have quite a few stabby bits. Oh, God. He's coming down. Buddy, work with me, pal. Please. I would have thought, if I had to guess, that his weak, sensitive bits would have been here. Oh, they are. But you just need the sword out. Okay, of course. That that's, that's totally makes sense. All right, one. Two. How many of these was there? Three or four? Okay. There we go. Come on. Oh, okay, he's done. Right. On to the next. Oh, you son of a bitch. You're not tipping me off. Oh, God, maybe you are. Nope, nope, nope. Ha ha. Nice try, pal. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um, don't lose your lunch, pal. Run. Run. Remember your training, and you will make it back alive. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ugh. Oh no, we're gonna get squished. I think. Oh no. Uh, please don't put that down. I need that to stab you, buddy. I need. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um. Uh. Uh. Jump. Okay, we didn't have to jump. Okay, um, well that was uncomfortable. You alright Argo, you're just having a bit of a sleepy over here, were you? That's alright buddy, don't you worry about it. Don't you worry about it. Now where's our friend gone? Now this guy is more like the mighty sandworm. Well not quite, he's more like a sandy dragon. Um... Where are you? Is this actually going to locate you for us? Kind of? Is he over here? Actually sounds like he's over... Oh, he's over here! So no, the sword was not locating him for us at all. Right, well, let's go. Ah, oh, you... S damn it. Right, turn, turn. Ooh. Ha ha! Yes! Take it, you bastard. There we go. That's sufficiently done, my friend. Efficiently done. We will make a marksman out of you yet. Come on. Yes! Lead the target. Right, you big stinking sandy bastard. Come back down to where I can stab you, please. See, I asked nicely. I said, please. What more do you want? Um, Argo, speed, please. You know, forward momentum. If you could bring us up to terminal velocity, I would appreciate it. <sighs> now, and I also still stick by the fact um, that I don't think these bosses are hard. But, they are immensely fun to fight and they are ridiculously creative he's getting quicker he's definitely getting quicker come on Argo either he's getting quicker Argo or you're getting slower I know what I'd have my money on personally I don't think you can slow down in the old head capacity much more but ready no 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 oh god no 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 are you inflating again no, you're not. Okay, fine. That's fine. Oh, yes, there we go. Right, buddy, your ass is mine. Or at least your strange flappy bit is. Can we jump, please? Thank you. Okay. Come on, keep it going. Keep it going, Wanderer. Look, we really need to give you a name. Oh, God. Uh, oh! No, jump, you tit! Oh, man. There we go. Okay, we, we made it. Let's see if we can... Oh, that's the top one. I want to idealistically save that one for last. Yes, controls are very unresponsive at times. Sometimes you have to push a button about six times before he does what you want. And other times, it's really snappy. Okay, so we can attack these in any order we like. Cool. 
Right, makes sense to leave the top one for last. Come on. Yep, hold on, hold. There we go. And again. Oh, okay, that one was actually weaker than the last one. Oh, God. That's fine. He's banking. Oh, no, no, hold. Hold. That's fine. Run, 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 run. If we can get a couple of stabs in on the other one, that'd be great. We might be able to do him right now. Almost. No, okay. Well, that's okay. Might not do him here, but uh, he's got to be fucked soon. Ready? Tuck and roll. Tuck and roll. Or at least don't die. Thanks, Argo. You are a loyal steed, after all. You're just a slow sort, but we can forgive you for that. <sighs> right, now we've got to wait a thousand years for him to resurface. Yeah, I understand he doesn't want to get stabbed in the brain, but... You know. We're not really stabbing him in the brain, are we? Stabbing him in the sigil. Uh, buddy. Come on now. Let's actually get the bow out. That would probably be smart. It's quite interesting as well, having the same weapons throughout the entire game. Um, I don't actually find that a bad thing. Ooh, here he is. Here he is. Aim! Did we get it? I don't think so. Damn you, buddy! Damn you! Damn you to heck! Yes! Good shot. Good shot, Hunter! Right. Just one air sack. It's pretty impressive that he can stay afloat with just one air sack. Well, to be fair, he can stay afloat without any of them. Which is quite impressive. Yes! Yes! How the mighty have fallen! Well, you weren't actually that mighty, to be fair. Mighty intimidating, but uh, in hindsight, you were kind of weak source. Come on, buddy. Come on. Ready? No. Too far. Come on, buddy. Let's try that again. With about 100% less fail this time. Move your ass. God's sake. You know, they say no sense, uh, no brain, no pain, no sense, no feeling. Which kind of makes sense sometimes when you're giving him a kick in and he's not moving. Oh, that was a horrible angle to come in at. Knew that wasn't going to work, but I tried anyway. Come on, Argo. Come on, whilst we're young. There we go. Okay. Ah, we actually have finally achieved a, a part of the game where I'm glad we have a horse. Yeah, this would be quite awkward to do on foot. Ready? Heave! Right. Your fate is sealed. It would be if the wanderer here would jump. There we go. Right, sword in hand. Let's go deliver the final blow. Ready? Uh, no! No! God damn it. That's okay. Alright, once more we're feeling. Hang on, did he just reinflate his air sacs? Yes, yes he did. That's okay. Right, let's go. Come on. Oh, please move, please. Oh, I hate you so much, horse. I cannot put it into words. Right. Okay. Nice. Just that last grub in the middle. Got him. Very fragile, this uh, this chap. 
if some rather standard arrows can just pierce him like that. But then I'm not complaining, because if he was any more durable, we'd be boned. So that's something to bear in mind. Right, Mr. Sand Dragon. There we go, that worked. Do you feel a little bit bad for Argo here? Come on, climb. Do you feel a little bit sorry for Argo? Borderline getting trampled on there. There we go. I'm sorry, my friend. It's time for you to take your eternal rest. Just clip your wings. And again, one more. Don't don't be like that, buddy. Time to ground you. There we go. That looks so painful the way he puts his sword in as well. He puts it right in there. Signs of Mr. Storm. Sleep now, pal. May the gods forgive us. Wow, you can see just how much our uh, grip bar improved from that. That was huge. I wonder if that's her soul returning to her body. Because every now and again you hear her speak. Well, you hear a woman's voice anyway. Which is intriguing. And another one falls. I actually finished this game today. Guardian set loose. Closed cliff. A closed off city beyond the channel. Oh, one might know what that is. It lusts for destruction. They don't seem like a destructive sort, though. I mean, some of them don't even attack you. Hmm. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave that here. Thank you very much for watching, and when we return, well, we're going to go see what this gentleman, this titan that lusts for destruction, is all about. Lusts for destruction, I should say. Um, so what have we got here? Hmm. Fourteenth and fifteenth. We'll have to do that. We have to pray at all the shrines. There's a lot of hidden ones here. Intrepid mortal. I don't know. I don't know. See, uh, uh, when I read up how long it takes to get the intrepid mortal um, achievement, apparently you have to complete the game three times, which... Yeah, no, thanks. Um, complete hard mode in under 5 hours 41. Let's have a look here, stats. See, I'm on 8 hours 6 minutes, and that's a lot of dicking around and stuff. I reckon that could be done quite easily. I mean, when you think about how long it actually takes you to kill the Colossi, let's have a little look. Uh... So that one took five minutes. That one took six minutes. That one was the hardest. That one took almost half an hour. Nine minutes. Twelve minutes. 
That one also took about half an hour. Okay. That was 14 minutes. 9 minutes. 14 minutes. See, look, 4 minutes on him. 17 minutes on him. 19. Hmm. Yeah, so, I mean, it could, I would say, from what I know, that's probably quite a generous time limit, especially if you... um. Get lots of practice in. Because you can practice against a Colossi. So. So, so, so. Three left. Mm. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, until next time. Thank you.